Let's start off with, um, with you, Kate, the front page of The Telegraph. This is a line here that uh, Michael Gove says that the housing crisis costs the Conservatives votes. Is this part of them trying to say that they're listening to voters and going to make changes in the future? It absolutely is. Obviously, this is an important time for the Conservatives to go back out there and start reinstating what they are here to do. And we know over the last 12 years of the Conservatives in power, I'd probably summarise that a lot of the focus has been on the fact that we've had Brexit during that time, the pandemic, and obviously this challenge with austerity, the austerity, the real cost of living crisis. So Govu is uh, the levelling up housing and communities um, head, is talking to the Telegraph about how he feels one of the first lessons they really need to learn from that uh, public vote was that they have to do more for housing and that there are people that are renting that shouldn't have to rent, that they're perfectly capable of being able to get a mortgage, just not enough housing available. And we know the government made a pledge to make available another 300,000 extra new houses, affordable houses each year, of which I think they're lagging behind. About 216,000 have been delivered in the years 2021. But for me, you know, we have a cost of living crisis. So this isn't just about people who are looking to transcend from rent to mortgage. This is very much about people that are looking to be able to afford to live. Mm. We've got thousands of people in emergency accommodation. Um, this is a little bit tone deaf of the mood music of the day, I think. This isn't the only reason that the, the Tories got the result they did last week. I absolutely believe that we've got people who want to know how they're going to survive and pay the bills over the next few months. So yes, absolutely, housing is essential, as is the restoration of our communities as we go back into the next normal. But um, to just to cite it on this, because there's a, a, a something coming up in the Queen's speech, no doubt, isn't perhaps the, the, the tone of the day from everyone. The bigger concern, I think, is the cost of living crisis. Yeah, absolutely.